They said he was 65 years old. I don't know about that now. That's a long life for a mule. But he eventually died. They rooted him over into that pond. Did old skeleton lying there with a hide all on him, just as tough as anything you ever see. And a big hole in his throat here where the buzzards and things would eat him, eat him every bit of they could. They couldn't eat him all. And I was a fishing in there one day and dropped my bait down there at that hole, that old mule laying in there, you know, all puffed up. I was dried up on the skeleton. And there's a big warmouth perch run out of him up here and bit my hook. Took it in that old meal right that quick, you know. And uh, he got off of there, you know, got loose. And I went to pull the hook out and I must have hung it on one of his ribs in there. I had to break it off. But I, I put on another hook and uh, dropped down there and I caught a big one, you know. The bones that had come out of his leg, the skin was laying there, you know, it was tough as a, just tough as a bear, you know. And I got over to about this deep of water and went down in there and got a hold of them legs and dug that old mule out on the hill and there was 114 warmouth in him, one warmouth perch. I could hear him a fluttering just because I run out on the hill with it. The water run out of him and I could hear him a fluttering in there, you know. <laughs> <laughs>